The IMF announced an agreement to provide up to $18 billion in loans over two years to the interim government in Kiev to prevent the country's default. The New York Times indicates that the agreement will hinge on Ukraine's willingness to allow its currency to float downward to cut corruption and to reduce huge state subsidies for the consumption of natural gas. The energy subsidies represent 8% of Ukraine's GDP. The loan package is expected to unlock additional loans from the U.S. and the European Union that will total $27 billion. Investors failed to jump on the IPO of King Digital Entertainment, the maker of the popular Candy Crush game, which launched on Wednesday. The Wall Street Journal reports that this was the worst initial public offering of any IPO this year. Shares fell sharply as soon as they started trading and extended their losses throughout the day. Shares ended down 15.6% at $19. In a new tongue-in-cheek ad campaign to roll out today, Taco Bell gathered 25 real guys named Ronald McDonald and is featuring them in the introduction of Taco Bell's new breakfast program. USA Today indicates that the market for breakfast fast food is $50 billion. McDonald's is currently the market leader with a 25% market share. The new commercial ends with all 25 of the Ronald McDonald's seated together saying, My name is Ronald McDonald and I love Taco Bell's new breakfast. Reporting from Millionaire Corner, I'm Heather Kiley. Thanks for watching.